my people. Top of the morning to you. So yeah, how I start my morning on the regular. I don't know if y'all can see me, sun probably gleaming and shit, but got my hood open. Checking for anything out of the ordinary, you know what I'm saying? Pretty much. Uh, you want to hear you just want to check for anything, you know, a little, little quick pre-trip. Pull that, make sure that's good. So I got the airbags, I ain't got the leaf springs though. No, ain't nothing to look. You just want to check for anything that looks not right. And for me, everything intact. You know what I'm saying? Check your belt. Make sure your belt ain't loose. Pretty much quick, simple. It ain't got to be too complicated. It ain't like, it ain't like we're we going to be able to fix anything that's crazy anyway. You know what I'm saying? Simple minor shit. Like for me earlier, well, not earlier today. But this right here, that's connected, I believe this is the water pump connected to this tube right here. It was a little loose right here. You know what I'm saying? So your boy got a tool set, tighten it up, and a little water that was dripping from right here. It was dripping from right here, it ain't dripping no more. You know what I mean? Little minor things like that we could fuck with, but you don't want to get back here and start touching shit and your engine shut off on you on the highway and all that. You know what I'm saying? I'm still greased up. This right here, all this is from, from Splash. I done drove in a fucking... Um, that shit wasn't even a pothole. That shit was bigger than a pothole. It was full of water and shit. So that's what it is. Dirty ass water. There ain't nothing leaking or nothing. I'm gonna get an engine clean one of these days, I guess. I mean, Lee Spring's good. Still greased up. Cranberry looking nice. Right. She looking good. Right here at the mid-level. Make sure you watch your antifreeze. You fucked up if your antifreeze fall below this line. Right now, she aight. She aight. I went to go get a new drive tire. Because this tire was low. So I done dropped before and change on the drive tire. The reason why it was low because the, um, the stem. Let that truck pass real quick stem was loose and it was laying air out and I ain't necessarily check it so that tire wore out crazy but good thing DOT didn't catch it boy you know just a quick walk through it ain't, it ain't gotta be too extensive I mean do your air test done did that already um need some fuel so I'm at a flying J right now fuel for 275 or 276 I ain't fucking with it on the way to where I'm going which is Greenville, Ohio. There's a um, there's a truck stop. Jim's Truck Plaza got it for two thirty. That's where I was at the other day. So shit like that, you gotta watch. You know what I'm saying, you gotta pay attention to where the fuel at for the low low. So I'm gonna head over, head up over there. Good to go. Everything good. Y'all know how it is. Get up out this. Try to hit you, boy. Have me, you know, kind of shit. Go down the road. Let me turn, let me turn Samantha down, man, because Samantha be talking too loud early morning. I know where I'm going this morning. I woke up this morning just feeling. I don't know if it's just me or if I'm still in the honeymoon phase of this shit. I don't know. But every time I wake up, I just feel rejuvenated, man. I enjoy this shit. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, man. I can't even front. I ain't gotta talk to nobody. I ain't gotta tell nobody. Not that I, not that I got a problem, but I ain't gotta tell nobody good morning. <laughs> I ain't got a smile, no fake smile in nobody's faces. I wake up, brush my teeth, eat some. Do my little quick pre-trip. And then I just go straight to the money. Anybody that that's working for themselves or whether it be legal or illegally, whatever you gotta do, 
ain't no better feeling than that. So every morning I wake up, I just feel as good as I did the day before. And that's real. I woke up this morning, I ain't say nothing to nobody. I ain't had to. I ain't got nobody calling me, telling me, or walking up to me, telling me this is what you got to do today. I already know what I got to do today. I said it that way, so I know what I got to do. Man, it, it's just a good feeling, man. Even if you company driving, you, you can still have that same feeling. That's what I Because I used to feel it when I was doing that shit, so it's the same feeling. You know what your agenda is for the day. So if you want to be in a fuck you attitude, you could be in that attitude and nobody is getting affected by it. You understand? Ain't nobody, ain't nobody, ain't nobody gonna have a messed up day just because you got one. If you just feel like that for the morning, you just feel like you don't want to talk to nobody, just fuck everybody. Ain't nobody getting affected by that. And all at the same time, you still getting to the money. Which is the ultimate goal. We still out here getting some money. I don't know, man. People want to talk down on truck driving, business owning. Only because they scared or they can't get out of here. That's what it is. They can't get out of here because they lay, they're laying up under some ass and some titties. And the minute that they, they, they get up and move... They thinking that somebody else gonna lay up one of them ass and them titties. I'm be, I'm be real with y'all. That's what it is. That's always the first thing that somebody, somebody bring up. Oh damn, you ain't gonna be around no girls. I'm be around the money though. <laughs> like, like, come on, man. Be around the money. I'm, I'm, I'm okay with that. That's right. Money on my mind, money on my mind, bitch. Money on my mind, 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 bitch. 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 Money But in reality, though, they don't really know themselves, man. I know for sure that a good way to know yourself or get to learn yourself is spending time with yourself more than you do with a oh, motherfucker. When you out here, everything you like, dislike, never knew about yourself, you gonna learn it. You gonna learn everything that you never knew about yourself being out here. You can find self. You can find yourself being out here. You in open road and thoughts. About 90 percent of the time. Uh, let me say eighty percent of the time. Eighty percent of the time, I don't go have no music on. White lines, blue sky. My mind just gone. My master plan is set out to the point where I ain't even gotta write it down. Everything that I need to know about how to get to where I wanna get to is already up there because I just replay it over and over. Ain't that like it, man. Ain't that like, ain't that like being out here. Yeah, you got your fall, you got your downfalls. I mean, you got your pros and your cons of being out here, which everybody know about. You know, obvious shit. But the obvious ain't too bad when you got a solid foundation. You got, you got no drama at all. <laughs> you ain't got nothing making you feel down about being out here. 
makes your job that much easier, man. It makes what you're doing that much easier. Everything frustrated, I eliminated out of my life. I ain't got nothing frustrated me in my life, man. Yeah, you know, you got situations where that you can't control. You can't control certain situations. So you can't. I don't let that shit stress me. If I can't control it, if it's out of my hand, it ain't stressing me, dog. That's just real. Things that are man-made, which I mean, which means that I created for myself, it might have the ability to stress me, but even that won't stress me because I know I brought it upon myself. So it's easier for me to deal with. Way easier. somebody telling me that they about to get out here. Shit, we need y'all out here. Revolutionize the shit, man. And let's be honest. This cats that um that pretty much paved the way, man. We can't we can't ignore that. I just gotta I, I just gotta call it how I see it. If it wasn't for um watching YouTube and shit, would I have known about getting into trucking and doing this shit finding something that I know I can do without any problem nah I can't say I can't say that for certainty that I would have known that so ain't nothing ain't nothing wrong with paying respects and, and, and giving shout outs to those that you know help you see what you're doing right now. There's some dudes that used to do YouTube, they don't do it no more. I don't know what happened. I think the young blood, the, the, the young the young gunners done ran their ass off YouTube and they feel some type of way about it. I done gained a lot of knowledge from certain dudes. And they ain't around no more. Is it, is it hate? Possibly. Is it envy? More certainty. I gotta say, man, shout out Casanova, man. That brother done told me a lot of shit. He don't know it. Now, I don't know if he still got his, his videos up on his page, but shout out to him. He done, he done, he done showed me some shit. Had souls to low, of course. Low done told me some shit. Still teaching me shit. Definitely shout out to TV. You understand? TV done made this shit entertaining, wild, wild motivation. You know what I mean, shout out to Wright Brother. Though. He keep that shit all the way entertaining. Ain't nothing wrong with showing love to people that you sat back and watch. Motherfuckers wanna get on YouTube and act like they ain't sit back and watch it before they got into it. Listen, man, I just spent hours and hours of watching, watching motherfuckers that I'm more now get a, being able to get associated with. You know what I'm saying? Which is dope shit. It's real dope shit. Because ain't not one motherfucker from my hood is even thinking about getting out here and learning the game and becoming bosses and shit like that. There's only so much I can tell you. There's only so much I can show him. I ain't into the business of forcing nobody to do nothing. If you ain't out here trying to get it, I ain't with it. Yeah, you get it the way that you get it. It is what it is, but I'm off that. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't got to be on that. That's the thing. So I get to, you know, so I get to chop it up with people that's out here doing that have the same interest of doing what I want to be doing. That's how, that's how you really make it though. Surrounding your circle with people that that's thinking the same way you think. That's on what you want. Definitely shout out OG SoCal too. I don't learn plenty of shit from SoCal. He don't know it. He don't know it. But these are the people that you gotta have around you. That's why all my people watching YouTube, you know what I'm saying, my, my personal subscribers, 
Y'all fucking with me. When y'all get out of here, y'all already know y'all can reach out to me and say what's up. I might not be able to respond to every comment because sometimes I don't see them shits, but. Definitely, definitely go on, you know what I'm saying? Anything that I learn, anything that I'm learning, I'm sharing it with y'all, man. That's, that's how it is. Each one, each one.